All right, people, welcome back. The end of commentary. We have a mega chaos here. Hi, I'm a chaos here again. Yeah, it's been a while since you were on. Yeah, indeed. Actually, I have been on 20 and 12 commentary for a while. Yeah, and I was like, you like you went on, you came on Skype. I'm like, hmm, when's the last time mega chaos has been on? I like scrolled down the, the playlist. I'm like, oh yeah, we need to get him on. He's, it's been a while. <laughs> anyway. Oh, I guess. Uh... Oh. There are some lights fronts in here. Yep, skill is trash, so we got house crafts with 1073, but we got Mr. Purple Penguin Ninja, even though that's not really a ninja. Because the size of that penguin, that's clearly a sword, not a dagger, but... <laughs> Ten How six... that person got the thousand rating with uh, that bad lights front deck? I have no idea. Oh, Chidolf. Of course. And Chidolf. So, of course, this is pre banless update. I wanted to see some Snatch Steel action. <laughs> yeah, the Net Network uh, pretty much updates the ban list uh, on the exact uh, date, the oh. 1st of January. Which sucks because then they're updating, then it's hard to get on, then everybody gets on, then it's hard to get on. I can't record Vitamin Y. <laughs> <laughs> like, I want to record Vitamin Y so I can get Snatch Steel. <laughs> swear to God, I'm gonna kill somebody. <laughs> If you take my ultimate nightmare, okay. If you take terror, I don't give a shit. You can have it. But ultimate nightmare, I'm gonna get kind of ticked off. <laughs> but I can handle terror. Yeah. I do no, I can't uh, summon my uh, uh, peak boss monster without the fear of snatch tail, like chaos number one of one and stuff. Yep. So or can... uh, number ninety nine, utopic dragon. Yep. Okay, I guess there is elsewhere fusion activated. Yep. Yep, you're right. Worst ban list in Yeah, Yogi's. I'm kind of sad that Chateau Fusion didn't get hit. I'm, I'm surprised that nothing got hit. Yeah, the only super poor day, but that's not really that relevant anyway. I'm, I was, I was shocked. I mean, is it is it ban worthy? I mean, sure, why not? But you know, did it deserve to be banned from what it did in the p previous format? Actions? No, I mean it got limited yeah. to one and kind of just sat there. You know? I mean, of course I saw it pop up every once in a while with Shadow players, but even when they would fucking draw it here on a number generator, I wasn't too salty because it got one. You know, if you would hit me with that shit two, three times, yeah, I'd be pissed. But once? Yeah, the problem is with Shadow is not with super formation. Yeah. 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 OCG put it just put it down to one, so yeah. I mean, and that's the point of view that I could definitely see. Yeah. You know, if OCG thinks that it should be at one, and they're the liberal ones, then here in conservative land, but I really can't even say that anymore. Can't even say <laughs> yeah, that anymore. I used to be able to say, oh yeah, you know, conservative land, we, we, yeah, we don't even know. Even now hits the top decks more than in TCG. Yeah, so. Yeah. Okay, oh, so sorry, finishing that construct. I can just the format behind. And we were yelling about fucking uh the artifacts and yeah we were yelling about fucking hat and artifact that was last format that was fucking last format now yeah, they're that like so you balance tech aside from the artifact engine yeah you know? and me being such a fucking conservative fuck you know like can we the hands at three can we have move one tech out three I'm like no <laughs> and they oh. play out the three I'm like oh. I guess I can. <laughs> hey, I don't like to move shit. <laughs> if I ran Konami, you would never get anything back unless it makes me money. Um, so you get nothing. Oh. <laughs> Wait, how did he get Squamata to send? You only get the effects on. Oh my god. Yeah, you already used that. Going through things again. Damn! I swear to God. I'm on DN, I'm a pro player. Look at my rating. Do you not even read your fucking cards? I could tell him at this point the game is such an irreparable game state that I, I can't do anything. Yeah, it's acting with BLS. Oh, yes. <laughs> Hit him with that double honest BLS OTK <laughs> game. I know, I remember when people, when they were, uh, some people were talking about whether Honest can go up to freaking 2, and people always said no because VLS would be too powerful with it. Yeah, that's a very situational combo. <laughs> but the Honest shouldn't have uh, come back to, to, definitely. What do you mean, I forgot to mill, may I? You have to mill, it's mandatory, you know what, you're both bad, this is stupid. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> 
Yeah, you can go ahead and mill. I'm gonna allow you to mill. Like, no. Nice mill. <laughs> Just block it all up. Is that all three? I think that might be all three of them in the graveyard. That's a very old version of a uh, light from the Very old. <laughs> Just like, like 2008 or something. <laughs> <laughs> They're both bad right now. <laughs> but they have a thousand years. Hey, their ratings are higher than ours, so they must be pro. It's very easy to get thousand rating on Twi Network. <laughs> you just have to dwell a lot uh, in a row. Do you have to take the sackiness? I said, I'm gonna try it. I wanna see if I can break the fuck out of Snatch Steel. <laughs> Maybe it's just one card. Exactly, I know it's just one card, but it's the one card that I can use seven fucking times. <laughs> so let's see if I can break the fuck out of it. Yeah, let's search it for, yeah. We've hit an armory and then... Let's hike it with a uh, sword at dawn or mm -hmm. something. Yep, so I want to see if I can break the living fuck out of it. <laughs> it's clearly... We have to... Uh, I, would, I, I know I know the meta's gonna use it. I know it's not gonna just skid by like fucking Regeki. Destruction is bad. But when has taking monsters ever been bad? Ever! Yeah, and at the end it's pretty much permanent. Seriously, like, for freaking, uh, when it was Dragon Ruler format, some <laughs> people were freaking, uh, you know, screaming for Big Eye's head and fucking, um, you did that out of order. <sighs> no! <laughs> you only get one effect per turn! <laughs> oh my <So> god! <laughs> And his opponent is like, oh yeah, shit, that's fine. Like, no, it's not. And you fucked up how that shit works. You send, you well, flip, the and then they thing both that go is off. A positive, uh, uh, for sure, that it, it, it is, it's a very skillful deck to use. So. Yeah, it is. It is a very skillful deck. Yeah. I, I, like uh, RGB Zero said, I definitely say that Shadows and Marmel is one of those decks that if you play, it'll make you better at Yu Gi Oh! Because if you fuck up the combos or you fuck up what you're going to do, you're going to get punished. And also Synchrons, I think. Oh yeah, Synchrons Also makes too. a better player. Yeah. And you learn your combo pieces, you need to learn what works, what doesn't, and uh, not mess up, because you're going to run out of resources. Yep. Unless, you, of course, you have Shadal Fusion, your opponent has an extra monster, then go to town. <laughs> but seriously, this this duel is dumb. What were we talking yeah, about? Oh, we were just talking about taking, you know? In the OCG, they hit freaking big guy to one. Because which, you can which take was it. pretty pointless. Yeah, it was just pretty pointless. You know. So what's the difference between Big Eye and Snatch Tail? Oh yeah, Big Eye is harder to get out. Yep. <laughs> yeah. You know, as I said, you know, at the end of the format with fucking Burning Abyss, they main deck Regeki so they didn't get hit with that fucking uh, the Fire Lake combo. So you just go draw them before you commit to commit to anything. You Regeki them before they can Fire Lake you. I mean, sure they get their effects still up, but at least you would avoid the Fire Lake combo, right? Yep. What's the difference between going Regeki and getting out of Firelight Combo and going Snatch Steel and getting out of Firelight Combo? Oh yeah, I just took your Dante. <laughs> yeah, so. I don't know. I don't know. I think it's going to be fucking Ram. I definitely think it's going to be Ram. Yeah, I think so as well. Definitely. It's pretty much a staple. Yep. Yeah. Especially since some decks actually have the equip cards. Like I said, I want to see it. I want to see Klee Plitz run a fucking Hidden Armory. Like, Hidden Armory get my fucking statue back, or Hidden Armory get me a sacrifice. Oh, I can't normal summon or sacrifice. Then Pendulum Summon? Uh, normal Summon is pretty important. Depends on how set up you are. You could just go Pendulum Summon, then equip. No. But it's, it's also focused around Tribute Summoning, and... And you have normal summon in that deck a lot as well. Yeah, if so you can't uh, if it was anything, they'd probably do Swords of Dawn. Because I think that's super cute. The Swords of Dawn during your opponent's turn, equip the, the Sacrifice, then you can't be destroyed battle during the end and equip, just, it's destroyed, then you get your search. I'm like, wow. Wow. <laughs> yeah, Swords of Dawn would probably be their card. And then Hidden Armory would probably be uh, Shadal's card since they don't care if they mill, because they would still get the effect. And they don't need the normal summon a lot as well. Yeah, so... So, this is gonna be interesting. So I guess the only deck that can't really utilize it to the full potential is BA. 
Unless they get some kind of equip. Yeah, because they self-destruct the if... Uh, yeah, something like that. So burning up this on the field. Yep, so I guess BA is the only deck that can't take advantage of it that well. You know, and what else? What else did freaking... Um, uh, fucking infantry said he's like oh get prepared for fucking um uh okay no i guess it is a dragon ruler build still okay and he's like get ready for freaking infernoids with uh triple uh reasoning mm, the text still won't too much unfortunately mm -hmm. it's uh very too inconsistent and yeah that. i'm sorry i'm like you want to you want to measure how that shit is like do you take setup to you know get into the duel yes oh then you're not gonna be able to keep up <laughs> yeah in fairness it's definitely need the setup first exactly you can't really go off first turn like oh but we have an otk okay that's nice <laughs> you better get super fucking lucky what are you gonna do about that bls though Star Eater, maybe? Or level 8 Synchro can also get rid of it. Like Who, Scrap Dragon. Who's effect? Who's effect? <laughs> yeah, <Is>? effect what? <laughs> no idea. Please. Please. <laughs> Please, I can't take this anymore. This is such a bad duel. This is. Unbelievable. I can't. I can't. This is bad. <laughs> Yeah, Shadol is the most popular deck, but uh, most can't play it properly. <laughs> yeah. Oh, you actually remembered? <laughs> you actually, you actually remembered? That's... Oh. Quit. Purple, purple Penguin Ninja... Quit. Cause you've made this game stay so fucking irreparable. <laughs> so fucking him. Oh, oh and that's the only thing that he <laughs> fucked up this duel. It's just stupid. It's, this whole duel is just stupid. So how are you gonna handle the BLS? Of course, if you see or anything, it should all fusion. So. Yeah, that's true. That's the problem here. You could have like that. one player pretty much has no choice. Yeah, he has like no choice. What are you doing? <laughs> yeah, you pretty much have no choice. I don't know how many light swords you have in the grave. Let's say, can you handle uh... mm, light swarm diabolus? Oh, alright, so it is light swarm really. With. Going for that B guy, I guess. I guess. Yep. yep. Taking that BLS. Oh, taking. Mm hmm. Yeah. <laughs> Very powerful in the game of Yu Gi Oh! So I've heard. Damn, if you were smart and you actually had it in your extra deck, you should have synchro summoned those two into um, Start a Spark. No idea what would happen if Chaos Emperor Dragon actually came back in TGG as well. Ouch! Stupidity! <laughs> Complete stupidity! If that erat that didn't even do much to that card. It, it, it still broke! Yep. <laughs> then the Oshis will be like, oh fuck, we screwed up, we should have to find it again. <laughs> oh shit, Konami's just fucking up. You know, I'm not surprised. <laughs> What, you don't want Mathematician's effect? Or you do? I, I don't understand. You summon Mathematician, then you special summon that. that. Oh, lol, fail. I, I saw that. I saw that coming. Fucking saw that coming. Yeah, verse 12. <laughs> oh my god. Let's see. Alright, we're at 15 minutes. Should we get another duel in for this video? I think it 50, 50 minutes is enough, I think, okay. for this video at least. Okay, alright then. We'll go ahead and end it. So, there you go, you saw a stupid ass fucking Shadal guy. But everybody can play Shadal, it's a top deck, it's one of the top decks, it's pro, you gotta play it.
Shadal's isn't one of those decks that can carry you to victory. You need to know how to play it. You have to. Uh, it's not Light Swarms. <laughs> yeah, that's true. <laughs> Light Swarms can kind of carry you to victory because of it's so luck factored. No. But Shadal's, no. And we can clearly see he's just playing terribly. Yeah, very terrible. Yeah. Mm hmm. I don't know why he quit. He had to play. Unless he didn't have any more lizards in his deck. Or hedgehogs. Because he could have went summon uh, Mass Intention, send hedgehog, hedgehog search. He has a Shadal Fugit in his hand with the. Uh... Oh, well, that didn't matter anyway. Oh, no, because he could have went for uh, Shikinaga still, but Shikinaga would have been. Maybe shot. Shadal player was out of Shadals. Maybe. <laughs> Alright, so we're gonna go ahead and call up stuff. So, thank you, Amanda Chaos, for joining me. No problem. Alright, so I hope that you guys enjoyed. So, thanks for watching, thanks for all the support, and we'll see you guys tomorrow with another episode of the Endo Commentary. Thanks for watching.